Shani Kumar, you're a former uh, Minister of Science, Technology and Industry in India. Um, how do you see uh, the rise of India at the moment? Because I think if I'm correct, India's GDP growth rate is now greater than China's. Well, India is still growing despite everything at about 7.4 to 7.5 percent. And we believe that if we were to continue with this growth rate, and we are aspiring to have at least 8.5 over, over the coming years, uh, we would become uh, one of the largest economies of the world uh, in, in 10 to 15 years from now. I am told uh, on the authority of certain uh, reports that by 2050, India has the potential of becoming the single largest economy of the world if the growth rate continues. But do you fear uh, a mood, a protectionist mood, coming in the rest of the world, in particular, I suppose, with the, uh, the election of Donald Trump in the United States? Because obviously, a lot of your growth rate will depend upon an open world economy. Uh, without doubt. And um, uh, I fear that uh, we are witnessing a process of uh, deglobalization in a sense because of the assertion of national identities and uh, ethnic aspirations. Um, I'm not saying that this is uh, particularly uh, a bad feeling to have at a given point of time, but if it means the reversal of uh, open borders and globalization, then certainly we have cause to fear. And I think that is why uh, events like the WPC sponsored Global Governance Conference uh, are extremely important to keep repeating uh, the fears that we have in our mind, lest through inaction or through uh, obliteration of the idea in our minds, uh, we cease to uh, make meaningful initiatives uh, to restore the position. Shwani Kumar, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you very much.